Hey YouTube, it's Tuesday the 24th of January. Uh, these are my latest gaming pickups. First item is a uh, poster for Dungeon Siege 3. This was from Game World in Leicester. Quite a nice um, thick quality poster. This is £1.50, uh, so £1. You can see it's double sided. Uh, next is the uh, promotional box, uh, display box for Battlefield 3. That was there, uh, £1.50. Uh, next, we've got uh, Summoner for the PlayStation 2, that was £1.50 uh, from Game World in Churchgate, Leicester. That was made by THQ, that was released in 2000. Then got uh, NHL 97 for the Sega Mega Drive, one ninety nine. again from Game World, this is boxed with instructions. That was released in 1996. <coughs> uh, then we've got um, EA Sports, Bulls vs Blazers and the NBA Playoffs, that was just 50p. That's also boxed with instructions. That was released in 1993. Uh, next two items are uh, £5 for the two from Sam's Retro Stall in Leicester. <coughs> Uh, Fatal Rewind by Psygnosis and Electronic Arts. It's a one or two player game. And um, I've found uh, Dark Wind uh, for the game track peripheral I bought the other day. Um, I yet to, pl yet to play this one. But as you can see, it's a fighting game. It's controlled by. Uh, some like glove straps which connect to this little module here in this picture it tracks your movements uh, next is Summoner this was uh, 199 from Game Station in Leicester so this is a uh, Summoner 2 uh, that was released in 2002 and uh, the last three items were 3 for £10 another game stall in Leicester. We've got Fahrenheit, uh, which I've read um, in Retro Gamer that they've put it down as a future classic, so quite looking forward to playing that one. Uh, next we've got Gunfighter 2, uh, Revenge of Jesse James. Now this is a light gun compatible, and it was released by Rebellion, who did uh, one or two games on the Atari Jaguar. This is a one or two player game and this was released in 2003. And last we've got another uh, game, track uh, game track game uh, for the periphery you can see there. Uh, I've got to get a golf club yet, uh, but this is Real World Golf 2007 and uh, this was released in 2006. Okay, so they're my gaming pickups for today, I'll see you soon.